Hello, today I will be talking about movie review number 845. This is Saw X, or Saw 10. This is the 10th Saw movie from the popular franchise from Ryan State Films and Twisted Pictures. Saw X is a 2023 film that is directed by Kevin Grutert which is spelled G-R-E-U-T-E-R-T. -E so this is from Ryan's Day Films and Twisted Pictures that I saw on October 27th, 2023 at AMC, at AMC Restrestor 18 in Restrestor, Ohio. So, this movie takes place between the events of the first Saw movie and the second Saw movie, Saw 1 and 2, will... John Kramer has cancer. John Kramer is also known as Jigsaw. Hoping for a miraculous cure, John Kramer travels to Mexico for a risky and experimental medical procedure, only to discover that the entire operation is a scam to defraud the most vulnerable. Armed with a newfound purpose, the infamous serial killer uses deranged and ingenious traps to turn the tables on the con artists. So, I thought it was a pretty good movie, and I heard from many critics that this was probably one of the better Saw movies they have seen in the franchise. So this movie takes place between the events of Saw 1 and 2, where we discover that John Kramer has cancer and he and one of his one of the people that goes to the cancer treatment center or there's a place where John Kramer goes that talks about people with cancer, people with medical conditions. And one page and one of the people told John Kramer about this experimental facility in Mexico or experimental facility that is off that is from this organization that tr that does experiments all over the world and how he taught John Kramer that how they have saved his life. So John decides to call this organization and he gets and he goes to Mexico to help to see if they can remove this tumor or to get this cancer cancer wiped out. However, he soon discovers that this has been nothing but a scam. This has been a scam to the this has been a scam to the fraud of most vulnerable. So John Kramer decides to use his infamous traps to take revenge against the con artists. Now, Jigsaw gives these people a chance to live or to die. As you've seen in the other Saw movies, he gives people an ultimatum, live or die. And he uses these traps to make people choose whether to get out or not. And I just want to advise you, this is all weird stuff, so just be warned. But, I thought it was a pretty good movie, and we definitely see how in the previous movies, Jigsaw is definitely a villain, I would say. Because he's using these traps to, to try to kill people. But, the con artists that are behind the experimental facility that, are, that says that they can cure people with cancer, and now they're saying that they that this whole thing has been nothing but a scam. It's definitely interesting to see that things like this happen in real life, that people do say, that do people do scam you with you saying that, hey, this, this can probably help you with your medical condition, and in reality, it doesn't. But yeah, I thought it was a pretty good movie, and I don't know if there'll be an 11th Saw film, but it would be interesting to see if there is. And there is a, 
interest scene that kind of ties back to one of to the first Saw movie, but I don't want to reveal too much. But I thought it was pretty good. Tobin Bell reprises his role as Jade Saw in the film, or John Kramer. I think he does a, pr a pretty good job of playing John Kramer. But yeah, I thought it was pretty good. So that's my movie review of Saw X, or Saw 10. Please enjoy my next movie review. Bye, goodbye.